Alright, it's me, the J-Spec, back with a Skyrim playing Dragon Break. I finally managed to get that stupid fucking map mod out. Actually, it's not stupid, it's awesome, but I just wish it, I just wish it would stop fucking glitching out. Oh yeah, I have Dova Bear. I forgot about that. Fucks up with the Dova King's skin. Statue. All right. As much as I hate this map, I'm gonna have to just fucking tough it out. But so far, we've been dealing with time travel, artifacts of the divines, Akatosh talked to us, weird shit like that. Figures. What figures? I wish it didn't have to come. To this. Yeah. Oh. 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 I had some issues with the last recording, but uh, I really didn't get that far, pretty much. She got, uh, Dahlia got a hold of an Elder Scroll somehow. Draymore came in, we went to her sanctuary, and then it, it was weird, like, the, the audio just wasn't right for it. Uh, I really need better recording oh, no. software because open broadcast. It's all it's no. all right. It's just nice because it's free. I was gonna use. I I thought about getting craps, but I'm, I'm just cheap life. and I've heard there's a lot of problems with it. Also, I really don't know anybody who uses craps anymore. Yeah, there's a death of the Lord. Um, yeah, you know these fuckers can kill them. Out of point. Now I'm gonna be a pussy for not fighting him, but you know what? Fuck it, I don't get shit. We're gonna hunt him. Well, let's kill them and save me, then. If we do that, nothing will have happened. They'll move. Ah, uh, like yes, the logical answer to time trap. They won't know we're here. The amulet isn't here. <laughs> the dead Draugr didn't clue you in? Shut up. What should we do about her then? Kill her. Now, wait a minute. How about we just engage in some rough, sweaty sex and you let me go? I actually don't like that idea. <laughs> Seriously, shut up. <laughs> Did you hear that? Teleport spell. We need to get out of here. How did my soul get into your body? Oh, seriously. Did this to myself. I sense practically still warm. I wonder. Do you hear that, Dovaki? <laughs> Let's find a back door and get out of here. We need to go look you up in White Run. Said I'm still doing this and I'm not gonna talk nearly as much just so that way I know what's going on and I'm paying more attention to it what's up chickens Who 
Who's there? What the? Contributor at Esprit Elite. I knew these would come in handy. What did you do? A simple containment spell. She can't get out until I let her out. Who the hell are you? And why do you have my body? I'm <coughs> stoic. You know you're trying to summon Mayrun's Dagon into Tamriel. Mostly because it's stupid. And we will. But also because Heretic You cannot stop us. Me into Just as this weak spell cannot bind me. Oh, no, 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 you don't want to do that. Fools. My master. Oops. What do you mean, oops? That spell isn't supposed to let them go. If they try to escape, their soul goes into the gem. And you didn't think to mention that sooner. I didn't know she was a mage. I swear, it's like having a drunk Skeever follow you around everywhere. Oh, it's comfortable here. Hey, Skeevers surely don't look as good as me. <laughs> Nothing we can do now. Oh, sorry for the quick noise. It's me showing my nails because I just need to cure the boredom Ooh, somehow. I like it when you talk paradox. Why the fuck? What is on your mind? Oblivion. Oh, I didn't realize it was you, Myla. Who are your friends? Oh, yeah, um, this is Alune, and this is the Dovakin. The Dovakin, huh? Uh-huh. Yeah, they were just escorting us. Alune here is the new cook. We never had an old one. Well, we figured you shouldn't be surviving on dried meat and bread. Dovakin, that is all we need you for. Wait out here. I have a plan. It better be a damn good one. Oh yeah, because you know you're only five feet away from them. I, f I figured that even most fucking retards be able to hear them. Well, that worked wonders. We poisoned their food and burned all their equipment. Ain't that a bit harsh? I also harsh? left us a note, and we picked up some relic with Mara's markings all over it. This time travel stuff is fun. Where to next? If you haven't figured that out already, you must be an idiot. Lead on, Dovagin. What is this? What are we doing? This quest isn't a- it's not a bad idea. Um, it, it is worth it. It is worth the download. Uh, if, I mean, I mean, you, you really got nothing to lose. If you have Skyrim, it's a, it's a free quest mod that adds more content to the game. I say, get it. It's not, not bad. Oh yeah, space spears. <laughs> I really wish they'd finish that quest and make like a part two to it. <gasps> We just kill you all. Really? Wait, that uh, wasn't the plan? You want to ask me something? I thought you were their priestess, you nitwit. What is going on here? I, uh, I think there's some issues here. <laughs> Tonight with an Iconium and two Kaijus. Wait. 
That's not supposed to happen. I'm gonna reload because um, that's probably the only problem with this. There is some minor glitches oh, here, there, but that's the what happens when you do mods. Are you ready to bring forth the master? Um, no. We thought we'd just kill you all. Really? Wait, that wasn't the plan? <laughs> they thought yeah, we even were their priestess, you too. nitwit. What is going on here? Yes. Is this killing already? I'm getting kind of bored. <laughs> Attack them, my minion. Shit. Oh, fuck that. You know, it probably wouldn't be a good idea. It probably would be a decent idea to actually start using that. I was wearing that. Now, unlike Matt's mistake where we got killed here several times, I will actually save so we don't have to go through fighting the Dremora all over again. What was that? Who's that? Nope. Kill them again, my minion. Another problem with this, I do wish it was leveled. I mean, I, I know that I know that is a difficult thing to do. I mean, I'm not I'm not a modder. Uh, I just I'm just uh, oh, slightly overweight, half Polish American who bitches about you games, and plays them. You know, that was probably the most brutal thing I've ever seen. Well, stretch that. I, I played out last. Come on. Whoa! Did you see that? Oh yeah, I guess I did. How did you not see that? Oh the pow, sap, slice! So sorry, I'm not made of eyes. I will say though, the interactions well, between the, the two NPCs is not bad. It's really not. I, I like the idea of that. You think? These fuckers are different, different mods, but they don't interact with each other at all. Having these two around actually feels like you have two followers who, well, they obviously don't really care about each other. They don't give a shit about each other, but it's really nice. I do like it. Ah uh, yes, and you go the brave. Probably one of the, yeah, if you want to do a serious, like if you just want to like actually seriously play Skyrim, and he goes probably one of the best companion mods you can get, without a doubt. Keep your guard up. I don't think we're alone. Like if he was DLC, I probably would pay like the dollar that Bethesda would charge for him. Fuck, he'd still, he actually. There, traveler, over here. The fuck you want. Never should have come here. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> fuck you too. Chore eggs and vampire dust. Perfect for making invisibility potions. Anyone 
know a good dirty joke? Oh yes, I've got one. Why did the archaeologist go bankrupt? Because his career was in ruin. Oh, oh. Alright, well, I got one. Might as well tell it while we're walking a little bit. So, three guys, they get stranded outside of a farm. So, they figured, well, fuck it, there's got to be at least something there at the farm. So they go there, knock at the door, the farmer's like, yeah, sons, I can help you out. Uh, just wait into the barn until I get back, I'll tow your car into town. Go. So they all go into the barn, they see his daughter, and his daughter's unbelievably hot, like, really fucking hot. Well, they're like, dude, we should totally, like, have sex with her. And the farmer comes in, last minute says, before you think about anything, if you have sex with my daughter, I'll kill you. So, they go, and they all have sex with her, thinking, oh, it's bullshit, he ain't gonna kill us. We'll just give him money for the car, and then he probably forgets the whole thing. Well, he finds out and gets pissed. So, well, after they go to sleep, they all wake up completely naked, bound, tied upside down during the day, and the hot sun is beating down upon them. So, they go... What the fuck? Oh man, please don't kill us! As the farmer points his shotgun, and the farmer's like, oh, nah, I'm gonna kill you, regardless, but I'm gonna have some fun with you. I, I want each of you to go out into the woods and bring me... And bring, bring back a piece of fruit. Go now, I may reconsider. So the first guy comes back, and he's got a, he's got a grape. The farmer's like, oh, I changed my mind. You know what, if you can shove that up your ass and that can one noise, I won't kill you first guy's like, well, like, I got no other choice. So he starts trying to shove it up his ass. Well, it's really painful, and he says, ah! Guy just fucking kills him. Second guy comes back. He's got a slight smirk on his face. He's like, what you laughing at, boy? He's like, ah, man, I'll tell you later. He's the smart ass of the group. But he's got a banana. He's like, farmer, thinking he's gay, he's like, all right, son, I'll let you live. Shove that banana up your ass like you do with everything else in your life, and I might let you live. He's like, all right, fuck it, why not? At least I'll live. Second guy just trying to shove the banana up his ass, just he bursts out laughing. Hysterically laughing like a clown, only kills him. So then the first guy and second guy meet in heaven. The first guy is like, dude, why the fuck are you laughing? Are you just a fucking faggot or something? The second guy is just like, no, dude, you're not gonna believe this. I saw Fantasy Tom picking up watermelon up the fruit patch. And that is one of the jokes I have. If it's pitiful, I don't really give a shit. I told it anyway. Thanks for all the help. You come visit whenever, alright? Hello, Devikin. Oh, no shit. I completed it. Well, this is just... I think this is episode one. There is a second part to this. Um, I'm actually curious to see where it might go. I'm gonna power up my character a bit more before I go back to the second one. I don't know what it's about, but it's not bad. It's it's totally worth the download. I'll, um, I'll, I'll, inclu I'll include a link uh, to the Nexus file in the, the description so I mean if you like this video if you like the, if you're interested in the mod and you have a computer download it it's not bad it, like I said it's free so you got nothing to lose um well that concludes it for this uh, take it easy